Hi everyone, this is me Bilal here from microcontrollerslab.com. In today's tutorial, we are going to talk about how to measure AC voltage using PIC microcontroller. In my last videos, I have already posted an article on how to measure AC voltage using PIC microcontroller and how to measure AC current using PIC microcontroller. But today I am going to start a, a series of video tutorials on how to measure AC voltage, AC current, AC power and power factor using a drain. So in this in this article I have explained how to measure AC voltage using PIC using a drain. So this this is the article I recommend you to read it. In this video I will show the simulation of this project. And let's go to the simulation. Uh, here you can see, as you can know, Adreno can measure voltage in the range of zero to five volt only. We cannot measure voltage uh, more than five volt with the help of Adreno. So we need to. Uh, develop a method to step down this high vo high AC voltage into low voltage. There are many methods available online for example. You can use a potential transformer to step down the voltage or step down transformer. You can use a voltage divider but both these uh, has own disadvantages for example if you use a potential transformer potential transformer is uh, is not suitable for uh, inexpensive applications or it uh, for example if you are designing a product and uh, cost is your um, main constraint then you cannot use a potential transformer and another method is voltage divider voltage divider is although a cheap method but it has it has its own limitations for example it has more power consumption and if you want to avoid power consumption you can use this method which is known as as, uh, as a potential uh, sorry operation amplifier method in this method we are using operation amplifier as a diffless amplifier and we are we have used the gain of this operation amplifier in such a way that at the output of this diffless amplifier we will get voltage less than 3.3 volt so and also we are giving a dc gain of 5 volt which will convert over uh, negative cycle into positive cycle and uh, we will we will uh, see both uh, positive and negative cycle in in the positive voltage range so here here we we have 220 volt ac and uh, here you can see i am giving up amplitude of 311 volt and uh, frequency is 50 hertz and 311 basically has a peak of 221 or 222 ac voltages so let's run the simulation and check it and we have interfaced lcd to display the values of voltage and current when you click on the simulation here you can see we are getting voltage of 221 and 222 but if you uh, take the averages of for example 100 values and display them on lcd you will get a stable value on lcd here i am just using uh, a serial monitor to display, to display the value of voltages also and here you can see uh, we uh, here's uh, this uh, basically a virtual oscilloscope in Proteus and uh, here here is the output of uh, uh, our uh, difference amplifier and this is the this is the output uh, of our difference amplifier as you can see uh, voltage peak is 3.90 volt and similarly uh, uh, for uh, other cycle for negative half cycle the peak is uh, 1.10 volt this is because we are adding uh, a dc gain of 5 volt and by adding dc gain of 5 volt we are basically shifting uh, the ac dc level of our ac waveform because we cannot measure a negative cycle or negative voltage with the help of arduino so this is the basic uh, project of how to measure uh, AC voltage using Arduino, how to detect AC voltage using Arduino. If you need more information about this project, I recommend you to check the uh, link of the article in the description of this video. If you like this video, uh, kindly share it with your friends or uh, click a like button and keep visiting my blog uh, and, and my YouTube channel for more videos on Arduino and pick microcontrollers and battery Linux and Artos. Thanks for watching.